Good morning, friends. It's about 4.15 in the morning. We're heading south to get Willem Cooper and Richie Rude taking a trip down to Canuga, North Carolina. Let's go. Stop number one, Willem Cooper's house. Taking us down. Where are we going? Hendersonville? Uh, Canuga, which I believe is in Hendersonville, but I don't know what town we have a place to stay in. Freezing. Mom's got skinny pants. Dude, they're stretchy. Stretchy. Stretchy skinny pants. How do you feel about cameras, Richie? <laughs> Probably camera guy, so you better like it. I'm that guy. Isn't this the cool thing? No, you can use camera. Oh, really? You gotta do it like a. I look like a little elf. Oh, you gotta pull it up higher. Oh, so like, really looks like the tip of a condom. <laughs> Is that good shape? I think you nailed it. All right, we're on the road. We'll gotta do it. Richie, back there somewhere. There he is. We're going to North Carolina to ride bikes. We'll see you soon. So hard. Richie trained so hard. Boom, Graham, so hard. I'm <laughs> flexing on the Graham. Nap time. I can say marsupial. <laughs> Tuesday is coming. Did you bring your coat? I am a banana. It smells like peanut butter. You eat peanut butter? Content. Crushing it. 18 hours later. We made it. Yep, to the house. She's stoked. <laughs> Tomorrow, we ride bikes. It's almost time for bikes. It's time to canoes, boys. Oh, yeah. Me either. It's very important business. You're being sensitive. Hey, I know. And I'm okay with that.
<laughs> Hold on. <laughs> There's no more top to that berm. <laughs> Felt like a little traction. Day one in the books. Had about five laps before the legs gave out. Tried to keep up with Richie. Didn't work. Still a blast. This place is rad. All pedal access. Around five, six hundred feet to get up. And the trails are primo. See you guys for day two. Oh, I think we're already recording. Day one of our trip to Canuga has concluded. Pretty solid day. I know all of us are very smoked. The trails here are worth the 14 hour drive, especially because the weather here is much better than it is in New England right now. Uh, I got eight, seven laps in. Jimmy got four, but I'll give him a couple extra because he did a lot of hiking to video. And Richie was able to crank out 10 laps. So Jimmy's gonna do a little recovery. We watched some Supercross, had some Mexican food, and we're gonna get up and try to do it again tomorrow. So like sick bro, we got so pitted. Good lap. Twelve in booty shorts. Strong booty, strong body. So there's no super cross for a couple weeks. What's up, dude? My recovery was at twelve percent and then I added forty minutes of sleep. We're at 40. We'll be good today. This is great. Day two, Canuga. It's early. I'm trying to recover. Big ride yesterday. Legs are sore. Body sore. Everybody's stretching out. Getting ready for another big day. Got to limber up before we rip today. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that was a J-Lo move. Nothing to see here. Where are you going to sit? <laughs> you guys are way off. <laughs> no, we're not hitting them. I'll go first and then you can figure out the timing. So then you slide out and then without swinging your leg, just using your act after. Lift up. Oh yeah. This is great footage. This <laughs> ain't cool. It's Day two. Day two. Off we go. The nukes. A little later start today, but I think it's for the best because it's warmed up quite a bit. And the trail should maybe be slightly better in the morning. 
25 half an hour a lap. <laughs> we did the climb in 19 minutes that last run. Not too bad. So Canuga is about what 500 feet elevation? Yeah. 500 feet, 15, 20 to 25 minute lap. It's basically up a dirt road. There's a climbing trail as well, but it's too muddy to use right now. A lot of people on DH bikes just heaving their way up. So kudos or good luck with that. But not a bad pedal. It's actually really smooth until your legs cramp, and then you're good. Trails yesterday. It's like eight or ten trails down from green to blue to black. They're fun as hell. GNCC was a good way to end the day yesterday. That was fun. I had two people in front of me, Richie and this guy Dave who lives here, and they were just swerving all over the place and trying to use different lines to pass each other. It was, it was cool. The Black Diamond Trails are wicked hardcore. Is that bad? Yeah, and they're they're fun. They flow well if you figure out the lines. Really nice berms and stuff. Everything's really well built. Let's go ride bikes. <laughs> yeah, boy. Nintendo mode is on? Yeah. as I'll ever be.
<laughs> yeah, boy. That's rad. Some Richie lines. I feel fast following you. Yeah, you gotta get creative with the ball. Yeah, some of those lines are sick. I hit all the outside one night and it's horrendous. Boys, the road canoes. How do you feel? Really blown out. Sniffly. What do you think, Richie? I am satisfied mountain biker. Ooh, canoes. Yeah, boy. It's a wrap on Canuga. Now out of here. Yeah, boys. Canoe. Yeah, bro. Canoe. With the jack. What was your favorite trail at uh, the Canoga? Even though we only rode a few. Uh, I got one lap down GNCC. That was a that was definitely the the run that I'll remember because I had two people in front of me, Richie, and then this local guy, Dave. And there's so many lines, so it's always cool when you're like, all right, well, he went low, he went middle, I'm gonna go high and just. It's just kind of chaotic, it reminded me of when I raced my dirt bike. Freaking rad, dude. How about you, Rich? What, uh, what's your, what's your one-two punch highlight? Uh, I'm just gonna... Pretty much a Willem said. <laughs> 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 I just like riding, pretty much. This just in, Richie likes riding bikes. But overall, this is an awesome trip. Last minute trip for us, just trying to find some dirt away from all the snow in the northeast. Hope you guys had a blast following along with our antics and riding and hoping to do some more later in the year. So as always, like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate you guys' support and keep riding. Woo!